quarter to three and I have just woken up. Yay! But I've only just woken up because I'm sick and I was up at quarter to four this morning, like still awake. But I thought I would show you guys this, which is mm, very cool because, and this, let's take this too. This is a little project ongoing regarding the charity event. So, what have we got here? Oh, that's my Hollywood star. But these, at the moment, are what we are planning, kind of, for the programme. Got a bit of Latin there. Mm, no idea what it says. Um, yes. And, exciting, exciting, they're going to be changed. This is an idea of the tickets. Yay! So if you haven't got your ticket, or you're not on the Facebook event, go and join, and send me some money. Um, now we're going to take these two presents downstairs. And I found my brother's present, which I couldn't find yesterday. My mum told told me that I couldn't find it and then I realised it was um, with the things that Santa Claus has already given mummy so we're going to go give these under the tree now look and there's a tree yay on the news of me being ill though I had some quite good news last night I drank a whole glass of my dissolvable paracetamol. Yeah, I'm ready to go wild. It was about one o'clock in the morning. And, but it was a very big glass. And I was very impressed with myself because I haven't done that yet. Which means I'm getting better. And I still need to have my advent calendar. I'm not quite sure it's the 20th today. There's a little dog. What have we got in here? We have got penguins. I love penguins. I do. It's very bleak today. It's a bleak Christmas. Oh well. Let's get on with things. We've got to do wrapping today. And we've got to put up my Christmas decorations. And we've got to finish the things for the... Um, charity event, but mum is... Ooh, how exciting. What's this? Ooh. I don't know. But we've got to... Mum's out at the moment. She is getting things for my printer so I can print everything. It won't go on. There's a Christmas hat. Um, and that's about it. That's all we're going to do today. I'll probably watch some films again. So I think at the moment I'm going to go wrap. Okay, let's go wrap. So I've just been scrolling through these Christmas movies I could watch. And they're all very lovely. Until, bam! Black Christmas. Which, oh, it says, An escaped maniac returns to his childhood home on Christmas Eve, which is now a sorority house, and begins... To murder the sorority sisters one by one. Why would you even think of creating a film about murdering people on Christmas? Any other day, it would. It's not okay. But from a film point of view, it's okay. But Christmas, don't spoil Christmas with it. I don't like horror movies, but even if I did. I still don't think you should make a horror movie about killing sorority girls on Christmas. I'm not very impressed. <laughs> oh. So I've decided to put all of my plans on hold for now because what I was going to do is I was going to sit down with the movie and do some wrapping and then put my baubles up and make it all feel Christmassy and yummy. But my room's a little bit messy still from the party and because I've been sick, it's not an excuse, but because I've been sick I haven't felt like getting up and tidying. So I thought what I would do is whilst I was feeling a little bit better, I'll just tidy up my room quickly. It will take me 10 minutes if I want it to just be tidy, but it will take me up to like half an hour, 40 minutes if I want like my mirrors clean, my bed, like 
Oh, it's just been changed, but my bed all like pushed up. Um, if I want my dressing room all clean, so at the moment that's what I'm going to do. So I can just have a clean room. So at the moment it is now ten past three, and I'm giving myself thirty minutes. May not happen in thirty minutes, but let's try thirty minutes because I know otherwise if I don't give myself a time limit, I'll just start messing around and playing music and dancing and not really tidying at all. So, by 20 to 4, I will be done. Let's try and be optimistic and get this done so I can get some fun things today. <sighs> I don't like tidying. So, it actually took me a little bit longer to tidy my room because I had a few hiccups because, um, see I've got four mirrored wardrobes there and that one now that one came off its hinges and clashed with that one, so I had to like take them both apart, like fix them again. Mm. And I haven't been able to, that took ages, and I haven't been able to do um, the baubles and stuff yet because we put them back in the loft, so they need to come back down. But it only took me an hour rather than I thought it would take me half an hour. But I thought I would show you what I've done with this box that I bought up yesterday. So here's a little thing, and then I've put this tea light thing stuck in with the tea light in the side um, and it's actually got this like I don't know what that is but so that's up there and then I thought I would show you let me turn off the lights because I've got quite a few Christmassy candles going so this is what it looks like in the dark so I've got three tea light candles here some love heart fairy lights across my bed it's the same ones across my mirrors tea light there, I've then got this tea light here, this Christmassy fairy gold candle here which I got from my brother and then this Muscadet, it's a candle in a Muscadet champagne and that is the pink champagne that me and my best friend Nikita have on our GCCs and the fairy light. Yay, Mummy bought me a new candle. I love candles at Christmas. I absolutely love them. And so, Mum bought me this one. I put it on my windowsill. And it is the Glade... Um, mm, smells of cherries. It's called with... Uh, it's called Glade with Love. Um, downstairs we've got the Glistening Snow and the wild berries and that's the with love um so they're all it my for christmas eve is i just love candles i don't know i always have um but what i've got to show you guys something very exciting um i'll bring it over to my dressing table because earlier this month i went and got um some jewellery made for me for my charity event um there is my dress well let's try and get it out there is the bodice to my dress so it's purple glittery and it's floor length so anyway I went to a jeweller and she made me some a necklace and I went to pick up today and I'm very excited to show you guys because it's very, very pretty. Ready? Ready? Ta-da! Um, you, can't, you can't really see it properly in this light, which is really sad. But if I try and hold it close to the light, we've got these little... Um, I'll take a picture of it and put it at the end of the vlog. But I've got these little just metal and then they've got these diamonds in between small diamonds going to big and these are actually in the middle they're light reflecting glass which has been coloured and this is a pendant drop so um it will just let me get it on and then I'll show you so here we go this is it on um I really like it because well I like it I love it because I think it's just so it's very modern but it's just so almost Edwardian classic 
these little gems coming to the big ones at the end and then there's just drop and the drop will just drop just enough for the bodice of my dress which starts here so that's very exciting and I love it very much and um, for those who want to know who it's by it's by a lady called Avis and she's just called Jewelry by Avis um, my name's spelt wrong on this but I love it I do um, so I think I'm going to finish the vlog here for tonight because I must take my necklace off because I'm just sat off on my bed just chilling out talking and not doing much I'm being told to put up the vlog because I didn't do it last night because I was tired and ill again but I've been told off today so it will be uploaded so that's why I'm going to make a shorter vlog tonight and make sure it goes up so I'll see you all tomorrow bye